Prepping your door panel is key to a fiberglass door panel build. Today I'm going to show you everything you need to know and everything you need to do to make sure you get a perfect mold before you start laying rings and think about how loud your door panel could get with your new door panel. Let's get it. There are some products that are a must use in order to get your door prep right in order to make that fiberglass mold come out perfect and the way you want it. Right here are a few products that I use and I have always got good results from using right before I make my fiberglass mold. It is very important you do a lot of prepping and make sure your prepping is on point and you use the best stuff and this is it. I will be showing you the process of it here in a little bit. It's always natural for your door panel to always have some oils, greases, dirt all over them. Uh, and if we want to make a fiberglass door panel on this guy, we have to make sure that we get all that off of it in order for us to get our masking tape to stick to protect our door from getting ruined from the fiberglass and guarantee we make a really badass fiberglass mold from her. First product on the list is we have some water, man. We're gonna definitely use some water through this whole process. Then we're gonna actually use some, to use some of this Dawn soap. It gets all the grease off of anything that you want, man. Always use the brand Dawn soap. With soap and water, we are just gonna be washing the door panel off, just pretty much just cleaning it all over the place to make sure we get all that grease and dirt on the surface. Once we get done using the Dawn soap, we'll just come back with some nice fresh water and just give it a quick wipe down. With some fresh water, we're just gonna give it a quick wipe down just to take all that soap residue off. Once we get done cleaning off that soap with the fresh water, we're gonna use this 91% alcohol. We're very, very light with it because if you tend to use a lot of alcohol, tend to use real heavy alcohol, you're just gonna lightly fade that vinyl dye, you know, color off that door panel. And that's a, that is not what you wanna do, guys. You want to go ahead and protect your customer's door panel. So wherever the door panel is not going to be built or it's going to be displayed, you don't want discoloring from the door panel from one spot to the other. When we go to clean, you have to make sure you clean the surface, then the sides as well too, because pretty much everything needs to get protected on the door panel when we go ahead and tape right before we do fiberglass work, because fiberglass can get pretty messy and it's actually rather hard to get off. It probably won't even come off. You got to make sure that you prep it good so your tape is thick, so you can lay some good, decent amount of layers of tape down in order to protect your door panel and get the best results from your fiberglass mold. This is something that a lot of people do not use, but I actually been using it for the longest about high tech. It is wipe out surface prep. This right here will make sure that everything is off the door completely and it'll actually help the masking tape stick to the door panel a little bit better. But once again, I am gonna lightly use this product here because if you were to tend to use so much of it, you have to gently apply it all over the place, but not so much in a heavy manner that it's just gonna make a mess and it's gonna ruin your door panel color. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel, turn that notification bell on to stay tuned for every single video that I drop on this door panel build. And we do a lot of badass car audio videos on this channel. I teach you how to do car audio badass builds in the comfort of your backyard, man. So subscribe to the channel, man, let's get to this door panel pro. So pretty much the door panel prep process is pretty much done. We are actually waiting a little bit for the door panel to dry so we can do our ultimate test. If this masking tape sticks to this door panel pretty good um, and is on there you know, pretty solid, then obviously our prepping on the door panel was on point and it is gonna make sure that we get one badass fiberglass mold. Later on in the week after we get done making our fiberglass mold, we are gonna be laying wood rings down and we're gonna be doing three tens across the bottom with two tweeters and one big old horn on here, man. You're gonna definitely wanna stick around and watch the full build on the door panel. These rags should show you how dirty it is underneath all the pores and the grooves inside your door panel texture, man. It's crazy. Let's get some tape. Cut it, put the tape right here. Let's just lay it. Oh yeah, look. You see how the corners, they don't pull up? The tape actually sat down pretty flat. Look, I'll do another one right here. Oh 
Oh yeah, our prep is definitely on point, guys. That tape is not gonna get up, man. That tape is definitely not gonna get up. So there you guys have it, man. I hope this video actually helped you understand a little bit more of the importance of prepping your door panel. If you wanna go ahead and make some custom fiberglass door panels, or speaker pods, or whatever you wanna call them, you must prep your door panel first before you even think about doing anything else to guarantee every single step that you're gonna go through building those door panels is gonna come out A1, guys. Now that our prepping is done, we can actually continue with the next step, which is making the fiberglass mold, which we will continue that in the next video. Man, definitely check these videos out. This is where I bought all the products to build the door panels that we will be working on. And this is just another video. If you guys want to get a little bit more glimpse or look into the channel, man, subscribe to my channel. We do car audio in the comfort of our backyard, and I'm going to show you how to do all that. Until next time, peace.